Hi, this is Brad with Copper Creek Cuts, a lawn care company in Northeast Florida. Now, since this is National Safety Month, I wanted to bring you a very quick review on some hearing protection that I use. Now, for the past several years, I've just simply been using those little foam earplugs that are disposable, use them for a week or so, and then trash them and, and get another pair. But after about two years of that, I finally started to get a little bit bored and wanted to listen to some music. So I actually ran through four different pairs of Bluetooth uh, hearing devices. And as a quick note, be very careful what you plug them into. They take a very specific amperage and voltage charger. And so I blew a few of those out. I melted the batteries basically, because they're very sensitive electronics and I plugged them into a phone charger that was, you know, for a battery, a lot more powerful than what that one had. That's a side note. What I'd like to do is share my experiences with the Isotune free system. Now this actually really looked good to me because the lack of cords. What I will say though, is that the very first time I used them, <laughs> one of them got knocked out of my ear and I spent about 30 minutes crawling around on my hands and knees looking for it before I finally found it in my lawnmower. Now, thankfully it didn't hurt itself and it wasn't broken and it worked just fine. That is really the only negative that I can say about the Isotune Freeze. They work really well. Oh, here is one actually other negative. Some of the music, it depends on the genre. Some of the music I can kind of hear. Um, the loudest it ever gets to me is comfortable. Like if I'm using a string trimmer or a blower and it's idling, so lower volume than a, than a lawnmower, the loudest music I have, I'll say, yeah, I can hear that comfortably, but I always want the music to be louder. Of course, that's a safety feature. They don't want you to put in hearing protection just so you can crank the volume up to 15 and blow out your eardrums that way, right? But I would like the ability to make that volume a little bit higher. So that lack of cord, which could be a pro, it's also going to be a con if you ever lose one of these things, and the volume is not very loud. I absolutely love the fact that it comes with its own charging case because that means in between lawns, you can just pop them out, put them in that charging case, and the battery is going to be charging while you're driving to the next lawn. They've got wonderful battery life as they are when you pair it with that charging case that gives them extra battery power and extra charging throughout the day. And it's hard, so it protects them from dust and dirt and drops. It's a really good system. I want to say it was somewhere around $115, $120. I got mine off Amazon. And aside from those two little issues that I talked about, I really, really like these Isotune Freeze. You don't have to spend $120 though. There's a lot of options out there that are corded. They're not Bluetooth, so they're cheaper. Um, maybe they're corded Bluetooth, so they've got cords to each other, or it's just a regular corded earphone with some hearing protection built in. Whatever you end up using, find something that works for you because the, the short version is if you're in this industry and you aren't wearing hearing protection, you're damaging yourself. So hopefully that short review and that short sermon <laughs> didn't make you feel too bad. Go out and get some hearing protection. It's June National Safety Awareness Month, so make sure you look out for yourself and stay safe as you're working. Thanks so much for watching. I really do appreciate it.